and welcome to another Teen Activity Kit special. I'm Hilary, and today we're going to be making some pottery inspired by Talavera pottery. Talavera is a traditional pottery style made in Pueblo, Mexico. If you picked up a free activity kit from Central Skagit Library, you already have clay and paint to make your pottery with. If you don't have a kit, check out the video description below or visit our library website to find out how to get a kit of your own. Otherwise, you can use crafting materials you have at home. Use the clay in your kit to create your piece. You can make a pinch pot, tile, or anything else you'd like. I'm going to make a pinch pot. I recommend working on a piece of foil or wax paper so you don't get clay all over your table. You can also use things like toothpicks or plastic knives to help shape your clay. Once you finish shaping your pottery, let it sit for two to three days. This will give your clay time to completely dry. Once your clay is completely dry, it's time to decorate it in Talavera style. I'm going to use traditional blue for mine, but the kits come with a bunch of different colors. For inspiration, you can look at the pictures of Talavera pottery included with your kit's instructions, and you can find lots more amazing examples online. Mexico has a rich history of fine pottery dating far back into the pre-Columbian era. When the Spanish conquerors arrived in the 16th century, potters from Talavera de la Reina, Spain, introduced potter's wheels and Moorish designs and glazes. The mix of traditional Mexican craftsmanship and the Spanish techniques led to the creation of the Talavera Poblana style. This traditional style is used to make everything from dishes and pots to decorative pieces and tiles. The tiles, azulejos, adorn churches, building facades, fountains, home kitchens, and more. These beautiful tiles were once a symbol of status, and to have home decorated with tiles showed prosperity. Although beautiful ceramics are made throughout Mexico, Puebla has always been the heart of Talavera production. Select workshops there still make authentic Talavera with the same techniques, designs, and natural clay and glazes that have been used since the 16th century. Talavera pieces were once only painted with valuable blue pigment, but over time came to include more colors like yellow, green, orange, and black. Creating Talavera is delicate, skilled work, and each handcrafted piece can take months to create. Once you're finished painting your design, just let it dry and your pottery is finished. So how did your pottery turn out? Let us know in the comments what you decided to make and which Talavera designs were your favorite. If you'd like to show us pictures of your finished pottery, we'd love to see it. Feel free to post them on Facebook or Instagram and be sure to tag us. We're excited to see what you made. Thanks for joining me for today's activity kit special. Stay tuned for more activity kits and videos coming soon. Be sure to check out Central Skagit Library's website and social media pages for more details about our upcoming kits, and be sure to subscribe to our channel if you'd like to receive a notification when we create new videos. Until next time, take care and have a great summer.